In a tranquil kingdom, a king experienced a dream three nights in a row, a dream that would transform his life forever. In the dream, the Prophet Muhammad delivered a firm message, a son of God was traversing the desert, bearing a divine light capable of illuminating the world. Yet, like many of us, the king hesitated at first, until an uncheckable conviction compelled him to act. His long journey to find the saints became more than just a quest to meet a chosen servant of God. It turned into a profound voyage of enlightenment, reverence, and recognition of the miraculous nature of sainthood. What the king discovered was not merely the presence of Boyazide, Albistami, but a radiant light that transcended the bounds of this world, a light capable of guiding even the most lost souls toward truth. What is the secret behind this light, and how does this story teach us about true spiritual connections? Let us uncover the wisdom embedded within. In a story full of wisdom, it is said that the heart of a true believer, sincere and pure, is a dwelling place for celestial light and divine blessings. Such a person is likened to the sun. When the sun rises, the entire world shines with its energy, enlivening everything around it. Once, a king had a dream in which he was visited by the Prophet Muhammad. In the dream, the Prophet warned the king about the arrival of one of God's sons who was crossing the desert and instructed him to go and meet this saint. However, the king ignored the dream and went back to sleep. The same dream came again the following night, with the same message. On the third night, after experiencing the same dream once more, the king awoke with certainty. He immediately summoned his ministers and his army, then set out on horseback to search for the saints. This saint was Boyazid al Bistami, who at that time was still seven days' journey away. After a long journey, the king finally met Boyazid. With great respect, he dismounted from his horse and approached the saint. He removed the chains that bound Boyazid, placed him on the horse, and led the way back to the palace on foot. The return journey took several days. Upon arriving at the palace, the king bathed Boyazid, scrubbed his back, and hid him in a place beyond anyone's reach. He did this out of fear of God and deep reverence for the saint. For seven or eight days, the saint remained in the palace, unknown to most people. One day, however, hundreds of Bayezid's followers arrived at the palace gates. The king was astonished and asked how they had discovered the saint's whereabouts. The followers replied, We followed the trail of light that radiated from the path he traveled. They found Bayezid not because of leaked information, but due to the divine light emanating from his presence. This story teaches that sainthood is a profound gift not to be taken lightly. Saints have a direct connection with the Divine Presence, and they radiate guiding light that can lead people to the truth. Their power is not just to inspire but to guide. By God's permission, the story also emphasizes the importance of connecting with a true teacher or sheikh. A sheikh who has attained true sainthood can lead their disciples to higher levels of spirituality, like a bird taking flight. However, a teacher who has not reached the pinnacle of sainthood can only guide their disciples along the path without soaring. This spiritual connection is an essential means of drawing closer to God.